growing out of the, the dissertation work, uh, where, where I tried to combine uh, sociology of religion and theology, uh, probably the best uh, American thinker I, I could come up with to help me at that time was Don Browning uh, and his understanding of practical theology. And I've stayed with that over the years. I've been very interested in doing a sort of a theological reflection on the, on the lived faith of the church, on, the, on the, the practice of the faith by the laity. So my research interests have remained um, an attempt to understand how God is at work uh, in the community, in the lived faith experience of typical people. Uh, and so I've done as much study of communities, actual religious communities, as I have of great thinkers and texts and, uh, and the tradition itself. And I'm as interested in the articulation of faith experience on the part of faithful lay Catholics, typical Catholics, as I am in the pronouncements of the bishops and the, the, the texts of, of serious theologians in the academy. Uh, the current situation in the church with the crisis around uh, sexual abuse, uh, reported, unreported sexual abuse of priests over the last 20, 30 years, has engendered a sort of a crisis, a large crisis of confidence on the part of the, the faithful. and. Some of my work over the last few years has been, in a way, to, to look at how the church as a whole community um, might discern its way out of some of the impasses that it finds itself in, how the church as a whole community might take a, a shared responsibility and, and not simply look to the hierarchy to, to discern and to decide how we as a community ought to deal with some of the, the greater crises and some of the greater challenges that, that face us.